Hey, what's going on, you guys? Uh, GMBS Happy here, and in today's video, I'm going to be teaching you guys how to install 5M Visuals or Visual 5 for 5M. Uh, so yeah, to get into it, you're going to need to uh, download the link in the description to get this file here. And you're also going to need to create a new folder, name it 5M, and put the 5M.exe, which you can see right here, and the 5M application data in it. The rest of these files here you will be installing later, so don't worry about having those in there. So the first thing that you want to take and do is you want to open up this folder. And I'll go ahead and make that as big as possible. And then we're going to come over here and open up 5M Visuals and make that one as big as possible. There we go. So you'll see right here we have the these are where the 5M.exe files is and then you'll see all of this. What you're going to do is you're going to go from here down to here and you're gonna just drag and drop those files. Now I've already done this because I already have these in my game. Uh, so you can see them all right here. You'll end up looking like that. Then you'll go back and back and then, or actually you won't even have to go back in this one yet. So that's that. Now what we're going to do is we're going to go to the 5M app data. 5M app data. Open up make visuals great 2.6 and it's going to tell you to go to citizen so then you'll just do that and then we'll go ahead and do common first so we'll go common common data data and then you want to go to UI and UI and you'll drag this over to there and you'll replace that file Then you'll come back and then you'll do from here to here you'll drag and drop all of those and then you'll go from here to here and drag and drop all of those. That we don't replace the map zoom data. Unless you don't have it, then it doesn't really matter. Because that is for um, the map with block numbers and everything. So then you'll come back to here. And then you'll go into the platform now. Your game won't have the textures file. So you're just going to take this and drag and drop it. And then after that, you're going to click on data and data and you're just going to take this and drag it into there and then we're all done and that file has been created if you guys need to go back and rewatch anything or pause as you go I uh, that was just a quick tutorial um, if you guys do have any questions though please let me know um, yeah no I'll go ahead and leave a link to that down below so you guys can download it and uh, other than that, love you guys, and I'll see you guys in a new video. Peace.